Please note that for the purpose of demonstrating this video, the therapist is shown standing on the opposite side of the client. For better body mechanics, the therapist would normally stand on the same side of the client. The piriformis is one of the deep six muscles of the thigh at the hip joint and is located in the posterior buttock deep to the gluteus maximus. To locate the piriformis, we first need to find the posterior superior iliac spine, the PSIS. We then need to find the coccyx and we then need to go on the sacrum exactly halfway between these two landmarks and then drop just laterally off the sacrum. The piriformis attaches to the anterior sacrum, so dropping off here is the first place that we can actually palpate it. We then find the greater trochanter of the femur, and the piriformis is located in a line between these two landmarks. We place the palpating thumb here, we bring the client's leg to approximately 90 degrees at the knee joint. And in this position, if the client moves this way with the foot going toward the midline, this is lateral rotation of the thigh at the hip joint and action of the piriformis. We now ask the client to gently press against our resistance, attempting to laterally rotate the thigh, and we feel for the engagement of the piriformis and we strum perpendicularly across it. It is important that the resistance is not too forceful or the gluteus maximus will contract and we will not be able to feel the piriformis deep to it. We can continue to palpate the piriformis toward its greater trochanter attachment in baby steps as the client alternately contracts and relaxes it. Here is the greater trochanter attachment of the piriformis. To trace this muscle, the piriformis attaches in a pear shape from the anterior sacrum to the greater trochanter of the femur.